Satellite looking into missing Malaysia flight detects suspected crash area. What's going on, guys? Make Electrics Thursday, March the 13th, 2014. The mystery just continues around this missing airplane. Uh, apparently, a Chinese satellite has spotted something floating in the water. However, the BBC World News reports this morning that uh, nothing became of that and that the satellite images were released by mistake. So, just more mystery. I'll put this link from CNN. They got a short clip on it. Um, got a couple links from a couple websites that I don't know about. Take these with a grain of salt. MH370, body in a life jacket reported found uh, on the on the coast where they said that the, the airplane might have turned and flew to the west. Apparently they found something over there. Again, I don't know the website. Maybe nothing. Got another one. Uh, fishermen find life raft in the same area. Uh, don't know about that either. Another website I don't know. So it could have something to do with it. Probably not. I haven't seen anything in the mainstream about that. From the Mail Online, did the pilot commit suicide? CIA boss says it's one theory the agency is looking into. Uh, they got a pretty good write-up here. goes on to talk about how apparently the family members are still calling the cell phones of those people that were supposedly on the plane, and the cell phones are still ringing. Don't know what that's about. From Natural News, six important facts you're not being told about Flight 370. Uh, they go in to talk about the black boxes should be able to be found. Uh, a lot of parts of commercial aircraft are naturally buoyant. Um, some more stuff here. Good, good write-up they got. Indeed, mystery just continues to swirl. From the Mail Online, uh, let's see. Apparently the men, two, two Iranians boarded uh, with the stolen passports. They got it. They, if you scroll down here, it says five passengers also checked on to flight but did not board the plane. Uh, another... Uh, more mysteries here in the Mail Online article. Put a link to this. Uh, this is from Al Arabia. Two Iranian Jews stolen passports and missing plane. Uh, put a link to this. From the Blaze, notice anything strange about the photos of the two men using stolen passports. Apparently they both have the same set of legs. I'll put a link to it. You guys can check it out. More mystery. Now, is this all a diversion from the Ukraine, or is it possibly going to it, be tied in with the Ukraine? Are they going to come out and say later on, of course, it's just my speculation uh, that maybe Iran shot this plane down, or North Korea did something, and and, and you know, Syria, and, and you know, is it all going to tie together into a big World War III type, possibly Operation Blackjack Jericho scenario? I'm always looking for that. Got one from before its news. Proof the U.S. is staging false flag for World War III kickoff with Russia. Interesting video. You want to scroll down and check out the video, uh, saying some information was possibly leaked. I don't know. All speculation, in my opinion, but you never know. From the Washington Post, Russia cites chaos in eastern Ukraine, gunmen storm bases in Crimea. Uh, I got another one here. Uh, what's this? Trust.org. Ukrainian officer says Russian troops ordered open fire at Crimea base. This has come out on the 10th. Uh, put a link to this. So apparently, uh, shots being fired. Got one from the, the Irish Times. Russia targets... I'm sorry, Russia tightens grip on Crimea despite U.S. warning. Uh, so, you know, I don't know if this plane is going to be tied into this or if these are just two separate incidents, but, you know, a lot of a lot of tempers flaring all around the world. I mean, I don't know. I got one here. Let's see. Israeli news. Uh, Gaza terrorist. Gaza terrorists shower at least 60 rockets uh, on southern Israel. Put a link to this. Not sure if that's tied into all this as well. And IDF tanks strike. Gaza after 60 rockets hit Israel. Put a link to this as well. All this madness going on, is it all tied together? All these all just isolated, uh, you know. In, in my opinion, the way it's looking, is this airplane tied to anything that has to do with the Ukraine and, and, and all that? I don't know. Still can't find the plane. Where is it? You know, all the technology on this planet and we lose a jumbo jet carrying more than 200 people. I find that hard to believe. I'll put all these links below, guys. I'd, re I'd really like your thoughts, although you're probably um, looking at all this with speculation the same as I am because we, we don't know anything as of yet. So anyway, that's the latest news I got. You guys take care. Stay safe. I'll see you on the next one.